Glenn, many congratulations. You are off and running here at the Grand Slam of Darts. Just try and sum up how you're feeling after that thrilling match. Uh, thrilling match. I, I, I'm full of bottle. You know, I know that if you give me a dart or a double, I will usually hit it. But no, it, 90 average is not the game I'm playing at the moment. 90 average doesn't win PDC tournaments, and 90 average is uh, lucky to get through. When you're staring down the barrel, four two down, Martin's missed two match starts. Just what's going through your mind? Um, that Martin has missed darts a double on TV before. Uh, honestly, he was practicing before we went for the bull. Terrible and he went closest to the bull, he went bang, he couldn't have put it any further in the bull. He got on that stage then, he was hitting far more 180s than me, And uh, but I just knew back in my mind that uh, I don't think his TV record is fantastic, and I was just hoping that when he had darts to hit 54, or 58, whatever he had to, two darts at tops he was going to miss, and uh, he did that. In previous tournaments where people have missed match starts against you, the record is quite good, isn't yeah. it? So are you holding out hope that history might repeat itself? Yeah, the Paul Hogan game comes straight to my mind now. Uh, but it's out of my hands. I, I really wanted to win 5-0, 5-1, 5-2 there to give me a good leg average. Uh, I mean, if Nathan beats um, Michael now, I think it's going to be really tough for me to get through. So, um, despite his interviews, uh, the past couple of tournaments I've played him, I'm, I will be cheering on Michael Smith. But I ain't happy the way he spoke uh, after the match play, and I certainly wasn't happy the way he spoke yesterday. Again, is that mainly due to the fact that you're representing the BDO, or just in general? No, I, I, th I just think I deserve a bit of respect, and. Uh, I just don't like his interviews and uh, I've not spoke to him today because uh, I don't want to. Again, is there more pressure on you representing the BDO in this tournament than any normal one? I know, I, 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 oh, it might be the wrong answer now, but I thought I was a PDC player up there. I'm, da, I'm the proudest BDO champion. I've never said a bad word against you know about them. I never will. I gave the trophy back last week and uh, I'm, I'm a proud champion, but I was playing for myself up there. I got, I got in through the back door. I, I appreciate that. I mean... You know, Nick Kenny, Scott Waits really, you know, could have been stood in my place there. And uh, you know, I wanted to win the match play semi. I wanted to win the Grand Prix semi. That would have put me in the um, uh, into the Grand Slam as a PDC player. But uh, you know, I'm here as a BDO champion and uh, desperate to get out of this group. Just I'm um, going back to what you said. Will you speak to Michael Smith over the next couple of days just no, to see? No, I don't think I. No, look, Michael Smith is an unbelievable player, great lad. I like him a lot. I just think I deserve a. Uh, just a little bit more respect and uh, I just didn't like the words he said. Glenn, thank you very much. Thank you. Glenn, it was a very topsy-turvy game up there. Just give us your assessment of how that went for you. Uh, below average. Uh, practice went fantastic and uh, I just didn't replicate that on the stage there. And you know, The stage is where I love to be. The throw is great this year. Uh, you know, There's a really, really big game in me and uh, I'm hoping I get the chance you know, tomorrow as a shootout against Nathan, but it really is out of my hands now, but I don't really deserve to go out the group after them first two games. You've achieved so much in your first few months in the PDC. Your goals, are, I assume, before this tournament would go on and, and make a first final, even win the tournament. Yeah, uh, look, I've had an unbelievable season, but I want more. You know, I'm not 30 year old. I'm not someone who's got like, you know, 20 years where I can gain a little bit of experience. I've got to get my wins now because, you know, I feel every you know, nook and cranny in the body now and uh, you know, I've got the experience there to go on a big run in the tournament. The match play was unbelievable, the, the Grand Prix was a bit different because I didn't play my best but got the semis, um, uh, but it's been, you know, the PDC is amazing. I, uh, I'm loving absolutely every second of it. The challenge, the production, you know, the players, you, you, you know, the, it's, it's unbelievable and uh, it, it feels a, a, a million miles away since I was a BDO player. Thank you very much, Glenn. Thank you. Thank you.